Yo, yeah, sir, by myself, bro. Who are you today, gang? Chillin'? Oh, today is Sunday, right? Nice, bro. I'm glad to hear it. How did that uh, meeting go with that chick, bro? Tell me what's new, what happened. Last night was rough. What happened, bro? It's just uh, a lot of walking and talking when I was exhausted. Yeah, because you had to like chop logs yesterday and shit, bro. Came to the house, went to sleep in like 20 minutes after we got home. So wait, did she sleep over last night, bro? Wait. Huh? She slept in bed. She slept in a bed, and you in a bed, a different bed. So you slept in two different beds. <laughs> he was shy. <laughs> So wait, your parents allow you to like bring go girls over to sleep with you, bro? That's pretty cool. They allow you to do anything? Bro, you got you must have the coolest parents in the world, bro. Maybe I need Romanian parents, man. Hey Hydro, how are you bro? They just pretty old. Yeah. Are you on are you an only child bro? Three other brothers and two sisters. Wow, it's a big family, man. Yeah, Serban was the first today, bro. So wait, do you all live in the same house? Only you and your parents. Okay. I have a small headache today, and I'm also doing laundry, so I might get up for like a second every now and again. I right, now give me one second. <laughs> Uh, hey, what's up, Lofi? How are you today, bro? I did not read about uh, C6 Chi Chi. 
Many challenges still lie ahead for Inazuma. Many challenges still lie ahead for Inazuma, but up. Uh Mar is your exam? I hope you've been studying, dude. Many challenges still lie ahead for Inazuma, but I am prepared for them. What, did they change Chi Chi from what she was before? Yes, yeah, serve my time. Hey, A Forest, what's up, bro? An Adeptus Art Preserver of Fortune revives all fallen party members nearby and regenerates 50% of their HP once every 15 minutes. I didn't know that. It's pretty cool, Hydro. Can you can you give me a C6 Chi Chi, please? Hey, Mary. What you? How are you, bro? It's been a minute, man. Sleep deprived as always. I mean, I got sleep, bro, but my head is killing me. Well, it's not really that bad, but we no one likes a headache, if right? There's nothing better to do. We could go foraging for ingredients. This man said he only has C0. And Barbara, she only revives one teammate, right? Two years of playing and no Chi Chi. That is tragic, man. You downloaded the Genshin last night? You started in a day, it ended last night, bro. Did you log on yet? I don't even have Chi Chi, man. Alright, first we need to sort out our resin problem. Let's see what we can do with some resin. My problem with Kai is that I have to farm uh, treasure quarters, and I hate doing that. Monday, Thursday. Oh, today's Sunday, so every domain is open, right? I need crystal flies. Where can I get some crystal flies? They're usually around the Statue of the Seven, right? I have time to spend on my phone. Yeah, bro. You had things to do, man. All right, Serban. Yeah. I know there's always crystal flies over here. Huh? Bro, what the? I know somewhere else where I can get some. This stuff is gonna be found by statues and teleport waypoints in Fontaine. Also in your geo hypothesis in the main outside of it. Yeah, that's exactly where I was thinking, Mary. so high in the fucking air, man. They, they disappear, right? I think they disappeared. Crystal Slide Catcher. But I'd have to go do Reputation Rewards, bro. Well. 
I have to raise my reputation somewhere, right? Which is pretty annoying. Alright, Hydro. Item amount max limited. Wait, do I already have some of this? I can raise two. So wait, did you clear the Sparla bit storm forest? And how's uh school Mary? I can't decide whether the hero's Up to level and three. Twelve is impossible with your current teams. It's crazy, bro. I hear everyone saying that it's floor twelve is impossible. What do you mean it's just impossible like to not get like all nine stars? It actually made me feel like I want to go do this part of this man. better with salt we until floor nine I don't have two teams that clear ten fast I think I might just push this to six. I need to change his um I need to change his I'm going to put him on energy recharge as well so I can get back his shit fast. Not impossible. You can't do the local legend. I keep hearing people talking about local legend. I don't know what that is, bro. Too lazy to build Hu Tao. It's funny, Mary, because everyone here has their Hu Tao built, except you <laughs> and me, because I don't have a Hu Tao. Broker is skill, and uh, what? More than her normal attack. I do her normal attack because let me see something. Don't you get like when you when you build her normal attack, don't you get more what you call it? HP when you do normal attacks with her E? Or does or is it not relevant? I thought they were like related. Because sometimes I use her to like regenerate everyone's HP. Basically a god god like common enemy. That is crazy. 
Yeah, Mary, I figured, like, if I raise her, her normal attacks, you're not sure. You have her benched. He's currently my only healer, so I can't bench her. But you just give, you just give me a good idea. It's actually time to build my Yao Yao. Maybe I should just, like, use my resin and build her today. Well, I don't have any books. Flies, you yow yow. Thank you, I didn't know that. Makes it so that they don't run away. Nice. Thank you. A local legend said shit sounds like BS, bro. So are you saying like F2P players can't even like even think about floor 12 anymore, bro? Like they shouldn't even think about it. <gasps> Basically. <laughs> so this is going to be the plan. Anyone who is not my main DPS bro is just going to be like. If I'm not going to use them to like do any attacking or whatever. They're just going to get like energy recharge and shit. What should I do with you, Yao Yao? What do, what do you build her with? Unless you have godlike artifacts, that is impossible. Well, it's not. It's just going to take forever. HP and uh, energy recharge. Mm. I'll have to do the HP dungeon though. For the HP set. Oh wait. Either tenacity or deep wood. I don't know what tenacity is, bro. When I think about when I think about healers, I think about this domain here. Which one is it? Is it this one? No. It's one of these. Yeah, it's this one. I'm th I think about healing effectiveness. Eminent skill breath increase healing received by all party members. Is this not um good anymore? Arl gameplay? No, I didn't. Made is BQD5. It's bad. It's bad. This used to be like what people use. Is there like gameplay out now on, on YouTube, Mary? We can look at it. Was on the live stream. No gameplay, just leaks. Is this a leak right here? Wait, should I even be doing this? 
I mean, I remember people getting banned for doing that shit, bro. You know what? I'm not going to do the leaks, Mary. Yeah. All right, let's look at uh, the domain. Well, this one, right? Deepwood. You're the one who's sharing them. Uh, I don't want to be the one like displaying it as well. I'm only encouraging it, to be honest. If I'm displaying it on my stream. Enjoy damage bonus. Join me for the domains. I mean, it would be faster. I'm just chilling. If you want to, man, I don't mind. But I'm not really like looking for anything perfect right now, right? I'm just going to do uh, what you call it. I just need a, maybe a four piece set for her or something. I needed to help with something as well, of course, since they're going to join my world. Do you play the new event? You're talking about the, the potion one? Not yet. What I'm going to do is I'm going to wait until it's everything is out and then I'll just do all of it one time. You didn't play it? I mean, I think Forrest said it's fun. I'm in a Honkai started, so I don't have time to. <laughs> yeah, you should have fun with that. Um, we're just going to go stand somewhere for us. I'm, I'm, I remember I need two, two players to stand in a place so I can get a chest. So I just need you to help me stand in a place. Too many good new characters I need to save up. I mean, of course. I always encourage you guys to go, you know, farm your stuff, right? I mean, there's no point just talking about the characters. You need to, like, be proactive, right? Try to change your character like she's mine. It's crazy. <laughs> One thing Honkai Star Rail. You can pick the stat of an artifact. That's, that sounds really cool. Oh shit, uh, I think we're going to need a, what you call it, a Geo character. Um, oh, you're going straight over there, bro? I usually go here first, I think it's easier to go here first, to be honest. <laughs> Can you make it? <laughs> I'm going to go here and use this. But we might need a, a Geo character to put a pillar on this. This will actually take us directly there. Crumble. Hmm. 
Dude, I can't even remember what it looks like without Dragon Spine. I think it was just like all ocean. If I can remember correctly. Yeah, there was this weird thing. I don't know if it's sure. I'm if if I'm correct. I'm just like testing it out. I think like if two people stand in this, you get like a chest. Thank you, sir. Really appreciate it. Never mind. This is what I was asking Jabri to help me with the other day, and Jabri was like, "Dude, your world is world level five. Things are too hard. Like, dude, come on, man." Don't be like that, bro. Uh, which one do you want to do? Should we do 80 or 90? Um, Forest. Which one do you think we should do? Every journey has its final day. 90? Alright. said it man I never I never even done this one I don't know what how it works <laughs> Nice, nice. Easy, easy. That difficulty of only three enemies will try to dodge your attacks. The characters will freeze. Ah, uh, okay. Well, HP crit, crit damage, ATK. It's actually, it's actually a good one. I'd probably, I'd probably need to put this on the traveler rather than um, what's her name? Yao Yao. Crit rate, crit damage, energy recharge, bro. How am I so lucky, bro? <laughs> Yo, Forrest, this is you, dude. You got a good. <laughs> Yo, Forrest, this is this is your luck, bro. <laughs> Yo, Forrest, I was right to bring you with me, bro. You're, you brought the luck, man. All right, let's go again, bro. <laughs> Actually, I got two piece for a traveler. That is crazy. ATK, ATK crit damage. I have HP on this one. This one can probably go to Yao Yao. HP, defense, HP. Yeah, this one is actually for Yao Yao, bro. What is this one? Wait, which one am I even looking for, though? Do I need Wayfair? Wait, Upper Elemental Cerberus if I can Oh yeah, this is actually the one I want. Increase Elemental Mastery. Wait, which one is better for the Traveler, but... Wait. I think you said Deepwood, right, Hydro? 
That would be this one would be Steel Bloom. Deep wood. Deep wood is better for the traveler. Okay. Okay, okay. You are not welcome here. Get them! Get them! Propagate! The tide's better. You can also refer to artifact recommendations and character. Dude, why would I do that? Then you're here, bro. Are you not the expert? Do you not like to be my advisor? You, Forrest, and Mary. Physical damage? Nah. <laughs> I can probably give this one to Yayo for now, the purple one. Four star, yeah, it's really good. Uh, I'm actually wondering. All right, let's go again, bro. I'll just use my um condensed resin in here. You are not welcome here. This is order. I wish we can upgrade four star artifacts to five star. Yo, that is true. That would be like a really good um a quality of life update. Energy recharge. Yeah, I can just give this to y'all, y'all. I'll probably look at these after. Wait, HP on this? Yeah, I'll just mix it. Just give her a bunch of HP stuff. They might as well give us that. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard about the strong box. I think I I just unlocked it the other day, where you can like change your artifacts or something like that. Because I have a bunch of boxes from the Spiral Abyss. You are not welcome here. Oops. Meet again. You came, you saw, and what? <laughs> Very useful. Yeah, we got something for her. This one. We caught. <laughs> yeah, bro. We got one of the gods in your helping out, man. Uh, you know what? Let's go. Um. Let's go farm. Can you help me farm some treasure hoarders uh, for us, please? Let me kill some treasure hoarders. Bro, Sumeru is so beautiful, man. You can use um the interactive map. Or do you want me to use it? So we can go I need some coins for Kaya. 
So the agenda is probably going to be to send a picture in the Discord. Power of life. Who's this one for, by the way? Wait, this is the other top tier artifact I acquired. Yeah, let me show the stream this real quick. This is the artifact that um Hydra does that Hydra has. HP crit damage, HP crit rate, energy recharge. Uh, crit damage at 41%, bro. <laughs> that is crazy, man. Melusines are beautiful creatures. They are the pride of Fontaine. Be sure to befriend them and cause them no harm. Gintama? Yeah, bro. What do you mean? It's the best. Wait, either one of us can? Okay. Wait, did you bring it up? Alright, you, you you look at it, um, Forrest. Because I'll have to, like, drop, drop my, um, game all the time to look at it. Big W? Oh, with the artifact or the Gintama wallpaper? <laughs> Gintama is, the, is one of the greatest of all time, to be honest. It's the GOAT. That's the off piece I'm going to give to my Furina after Raiden build is done. Nice, bro. Hey Nigel, what's up bro? How are you man? Alright, I have to keep an eye on Forrest so I don't like have him waiting too long. Oh, it's breakfast bro? Uh, Alright bro. Alright, so we can just stop the co-op then and we can uh, do the farming later. Alright, take your time and enjoy your breakfast bro. I'll probably go start the the main scenario quest right now, the MSQ. Where is it? Let's go do the MSQ. And we can uh we can continue farming later. Forest. How is the team building for the spiral abyss, Nigel? I need to remember to do my commissions, bro. Are these things what they call the melusine? Can you admit, can you believe that there's a, a half Melusine uh, chick in the game? The nurse in the prison? They built for Abyss. It's not good, bro. Oh, God, man. Keep it up, bro. You got this. Where is the prison again? It's at Oprah Epic Lens, right? Underwater. Jesus Christ. Wait, is the prison... It's not the Oprah Epicus. Wait, the Oprah Epicus is where the... There should be a teleport point here. Forest man, just keep it up, bro. You got this. I can't find my quest, bro. It's underwater. There we go. Your attack units are prepped up, but I didn't build any supports. Dude, I know you got this, man. You have... a. A lot of different god builds. You don't even need supports, really. You can just run around with, like all DPS characters. 
and you'll be fine. Big storage device and energy transfer device. Storage devices can provide energy to transfer on, on research terminals. Pick up a portable storage device and put it next to a terminal that has a stop function to return it to normal operation. Interesting. Let's come up. So they're saying I'm supposed to pick up one of these. Go to the production zone to talk to Grain Zone. Might be upstairs above me. There's this little chick, bro. This Hydro chick, she's a nurse in here. She's a half Melusine. Can you imagine that a human would look at one of those creatures and have sex with it? When, when I saw the little chick, I was flabbergasted, bro. Talk to Brainville, the production zone. I mean, they say that, but I don't know how to get there. Does this one go downstairs? We are going to do um, some more exploration later, bro, or some more farming. I'm current. I'm just going to start doing the MSQ now, so we stay on track. Yeah, man, you should, dude. I hope you didn't rush yourself, bro. Should have just enjoyed your breakfast. I'm looking for the quest and I'm lost, bro. It says 115 meters. It's right here. It's not above and it's not below. Uh, it must be below. It should be below. go to the production zone. Wait, let me look at the map. I think that's upstairs.
it's complex at first. Bro, they're, they marked a point and they're saying go to the production zone. I was there. At the point, it's not there. I went upstairs, at the point, it's not there. So the only thing left to do is go down, right? But I can't find the elevator. I looked at the map. The map is showing me the same place, just in different sections. This is look like this is what I mean, right? I'm at this area right now. I do this. They show the large part, right? I do this. They show a different section within the same uh, large part. I do this. They show me this part within the same large part. I'm like, what the? What is this, man? It doesn't make sense. I mean, it's not as bad as Ulda in Final Fantasy. I did the world quest in Fortress. It's so annoying, Hydro. It's so annoying, bro. I know I'm an I'm annoyed because I'm stuck in this elevator and it's been going down for a while now. Look at this. I was actually supposed to go inside the office. Oh no. I'm not supposed to go inside the office. I'm supposed to <laughs> I'm supposed to exit the <laughs> Bro, I I'm having a headache, man. I can't handle this, bro. It's about the gold dust on the ground. It's this, I'm pretty sure this is pointing down, bro. But how do we go downstairs? Oh, wait. Oh, there it is. I guess it was just bugged the first time. Catch of the day. Looks like you've got some luck getting assigned this space. Yep, we just arrived yesterday and. Don't interrupt me when I'm speaking! Oh yes, shit. Sir. Listen oh, carefully to my instructions. I don't want any mishaps. Every machine here is worth more than the both of you. Working around these machines can be very dangerous. Do your job well, and you can eat in the cafeteria after your shift. Get sloppy. And you dine in the infirmary. Anyway, the Fortress of Merope doesn't want to lose a single one of its machines. And it also doesn't <laughs> want to waste the production potential of, of the any day. inmate. You got that? Got it! Your job is to use the machine over there to process widgets. Watch carefully, and make sure you step on the pedal at the right time. If the machine gets jammed, then give it a little maintenance with your fist. Here, take this. Bring me the process widgets, and I'll give you some credit coupons in exchange. Credit okay, coupons, we need those. For the modeling process, you must place the 
unprocessed parts into the machine and then interact with the machine to start challenge. When some parts get stuck, When some parts get stuck while rotating, you will need to attack the rotating part to restore the machine's function. When the part's base glows, jump, complete the modeling process once. Interesting. When you finish, you must retrieve the successful process parts. Alright, let's see if we remember. Stand on this. Place the part. Start the processing. So if the machine gets jammed, you just need to attack it to fix the Beat it up. Beat it up. What can a prison allow Once you to have swords? To blow, jump to step on the pedal and hit the widget with the hammer. Bro, I'm doing factory work, bro. one is tolerable though since the processing is done by machine the product is all pretty Basically. much the same anyway all right i'll pass you for now and we'll count up how many credit coupons you've earned Ooh, credit coupons i need to buy stuff bro <sighs> buy some cigarettes i'm exhausted we're done now right she's oh, exhausted from me. telling me what to do so Cafeteria. We still need to meet Lenny first, right? He probably just finished up his work, too. He should be around here somewhere. Buy some cigs, of course, bro. It's not even the coupon. Cigs are the actual currency in prison, bro. I hate shedding ashes. You'll go for e cigs? <laughs> I mean, if that works for you, that works for you, man. I don't think it has the same effect, though. But I shouldn't be talking about cigs on here. But wait, you're 21, right? Do you even smoke hydro? Wait, you told me a story one time. You said you went somewhere and your brothers were smoking, right? Oh, yeah, in London, right? They smoke to stay warm. Your luck isn't here, but elsewhere. Try your luck near nearby cipher letters. Yeah, I remember. So wait, do you smoke hydro? Consider the gift from fate. Is that like some riddle or something? <sighs> hey, this bear. How are you, bro? He's actually above, I think. But his, uh, this prison quest is pretty ass, bro. You're in this big prison and you're lost.
Of course, sounds good, man. How's the construction going on in the teapot? If you press V, it makes the partial trail show. Thank you. Hey, over here. Oh, you scared Paimon! How'd you appear out of nowhere like that? The water already gives me anxiety. Oh, you scare so easily now? Is there something worrying you these days? You little... The only thing we're worried about was trying to find you! <laughs> sorry, sorry. Come over here and keep it down. Well, if you build a prison like that, you know they have no way of getting away, right? That's one of the worst prisons that oh, they had in America at one time. There you two! You two really are inseparable. That's right. My brother simply can't was on stand an island to be away from me. Surrounded by water. People didn't really get uh, away from that, bro. It's not just Lynette. Fremine is also here. Why are you guys you in prison? Do still remember him? Yeah, your little brother. Oh! You mean that diver from the House of the Hearth, right? Pyro remembers seeing him in the Court of Fontaine before. Just one step at a time. You tell us. How did you end up as criminals this time? We fought so hard at court to prove you were innocent, but now it looks like our incredible court battle was for nothing! Sadly, even the teeniest of things can land you in prison these days. I put together a street performance and used the popularity we gained from the Opera House incident to attract a big crowd. And then? Next, I invited several audience members to participate in the show. And then, with the entire audience watching, their wallet suddenly disappeared. My brother was charged with theft, and I was charged as his accomplice, having assisted him in his crime. Lynette the cat girl, yeah, but she's pretty boring, man. It really isn't that bad. I wish she was a little the bit more excited. The all in the leftmost drawer of the Maison Guardianage's big filing cabinet. We just need to see how long it takes to discover them. Yep, we should be released then. In terms of the magic trick itself, I think the performance went perfectly. <sighs> Leave it to Lenny to magic himself into prison. Indeed. Last time I hid my identity from you, I promised that I'd tell you absolutely everything if you were angry about it. No more You're secrets. You're still to see the sky? I so mean, when I you look out and you see the blue water, it should either. be relaxing, man. At the moment, the House of the Hearth's interests don't conflict look into with yours how cold at all. It is. We were instructed by the father of our house, the Knave, to come here and conduct an investigation. So all about metal? So what if we're all in the Matrix, <gasps> man, and like, the real world is us As lying in a, a structure surrounded by metal, and our brains are connected to something? <laughs> Some even say that the entire uh, everything we're seeing right now is a simulation, it. bro, in the Matrix. The House of the Hearth has been investigating this for a very long time, trying to uncover its mysteries. But recently, all of our informants, including the ones that had infiltrated the guards, suddenly vanished and have not been heard from since. We believe that this is a direct provocation, and it's the reason why we came here. Father has somehow managed to confirm that Fossilors does not have Fontaine's Gnosis. Fossilor well, doesn't? I was wondering where it is. How did she manage to learn information that important? Father has her ways. Many of them are beyond our imagination, and we've never had the chance to see her at work. But we trust her conclusions. It was this information that led us to suspect that Fontaine's Gnosis might be in the fortress of Meripede and is related to that secret. So it's all about the Gnosis again. Well, that's about it from our side. How about you two? Did Monsieur Nervulet send you Red here? Skill level eight. Bingo! And your Lina's kitchen was skill level fishing. nine. She wants to know what happened to Child, so we can Yeah, I'm going to build her as my main uh, animal character since Jasmine, she's free. Are we allowed to tell them? You don't need to worry too much about that. She's just asking for a report on Master Child's predicament as a means of pressuring you. Father used this situation as a pretext to negotiate with two high-ranking officials in the Court of Fontaine. She actually just wants to be able to make concessions on this matter for gains elsewhere. Almost like a bargaining chip. Sometimes you need an excuse to do things you otherwise couldn't. 
And a harbinger is more valuable than you might imagine. Of course, it's not a complete farce. If we do manage to find out what happened to Master Child too, then diplomatic relations with Fontaine could improve, and Snezhnaya might even be able to adjust its stance a bit. Is it just Paimon, or does it feel like we're the only ones who actually care about Child's situation? The relationship between the Harbingers must be as bad as ever. I don't really I care about Child's situation, far. though. Father just has different standards than we do when it comes to what can be sacrificed for an advantage. Uh, by the way, I have a suggestion. Why don't we team up? I don't Even know, man. Maybe it's only because when Ed is a new character, to investigate the fortress Ed is my only people. build animal character as of now. Yeah, together. she's going to be my as only build know, animal character. Apart from Traveler. Gnosis, Traveler isn't so bad. But I don't like her his gameplay anymore. You can trust the us animal version. See, I told you. Is that so? Hmm. Sure enough, it won't be easy to convince them to cooperate with us. Lenny seems to be thinking pretty hard about something. Of course he is. Lenny has been looking forward That's to a chance to reach an understanding Hydro. with you ever since last we met. Or, I should say, we were really looking forward to teaming up with you this time. Lynette, just tell them everything, why don't you? Don't team up with me. I would like to fight you and kill you it's both. It's okay to open up I would like to fight and kill both of these characters, to be honest. <laughs> Very prudent of you, and consistent with your behavior since we first met. That's reasonable enough, and I agreed to cooperate on these terms as well. Dude, my characters, we've never killed worst, anyone in this game. But you were actually more agreeable than I anticipated. Maybe Vivi? All right, then. There's no time to lose. I have some information to share, so listen carefully. Since Lynette and I arrived here, our investigation uncovered the fact that the fortress of Meripede has oh, wait. a forbidden Serban. zone. I need to write 15 recipes for our sweets talk, till but tomorrow. After asking the right questions, we were able to confirm the existence of the Forbidden Zone from the gods. I don't know any recipes for sweets, bro. You should be bro. aware of that while you're investigating. A Forbidden Zone? <gasps> Could that be where Charles disappeared Welcome back, Serban. You're right. We'll definitely keep that in mind. Good. That's the most suspicious thing about the fortress that we know of so far. We have a few other unanswered questions, and we'll be investigating those as quickly as we can. Anyway, I hope you find our information useful at least. Oh, look at the time. You two must be hungry. You should go to the coupon cafeteria and get something to eat. I'll use my cards to get in touch with you again in the future. Oh, that's just what Paimon wanted to hear! Paimon's starving after all that work today. We can talk more about the investigation later. Let's go get some grub! I wish I was listening to what these people were saying. That wasn't. Tough tears downstairs.
What is this now? What is it this time, bro? Uh, I don't even know why I'm here. Welfare meals, that's crazy. Puzzle is puzzling you? Bro, this place is giving me a headache, man. It's not the right oh, day to play this. He wasn't kidding. The story quest. This meal is nowhere near as good as last time. Oh, who knows how long it'll be until we're lucky enough to get that super tasty meal again. Ah, forget about it then. We'll just deal with the regular food for the time being. Let's just get out of here as soon as possible. But life here doesn't seem all that bad. Other than the foreman being kind of mean and the work being pretty tiring. You think so, mate? <laughs> if I had a coupon for every fish who said that. Seems you fishies still haven't learned your lessons from your life Why do they call the people fishies? If you take That's things so at weird. face value, then by the time you reach a dead end, you won't even know how you ended up on that road in the first place. That... Alright, signature? Just on this time in the story? <laughs> I like your attitude. I can uh, let you in on a little something. I don't Everyone's care. Everyone's been telling you to I just follow hear. the rules and not cause any trouble for yourself. Am I right? But what they don't do is that the rules are exactly what they pretend to be. Well. The rules for being a prisoner. I don't want to hear it. The truth is, this place has a lot of hidden rules. I don't care. Huh? Hidden rules? What do you mean? Not everyone knows about those rules, but whether you know them or not, once you break one, you might encounter something even worse than death. Really? Oh, now you're really scaring poor- Of course. And I'd say that just disappearing would be one of the better outcomes. Oh, you mean that if there really are hidden rules, then child's disappearance might have something to do with that? Uh, in that case, would you tell us some hidden rules? We definitely want to avoid breaking them. <laughs> Come on, mate. This is valuable information. The difference between life and death. Do you really think you can just ask and I would tell you? Paimon understands, but we don't have many credit coupons yet. Yeah, yeah, I know. Not like I'm going anywhere. Just come talk to me after you've saved enough. Moreover, your new fish, freshly caught and completely out of your element. What'd be the point in even telling you anything before you've gotten a handle on your new lives? Come and find me once you've been here longer. I'm usually around the rag and bone shop. Just call me V-Doc. Bye bye now. Phoenix made a blunder and accidentally spoiled you. Sorry. He left. Just like that. Huh. Do you think he's just trying to scare us into buying fake information from him? Yeah. It might be a good place to start in our investigation. Hidden rules, huh? But, like he said, we don't have any coupons and we're still not familiar with this place. Oh, there's nothing we can do about it now. We were so busy talking, we almost forgot to eat. Even if it's not the best, it's probably better while it's warm. Come on, dig in before it gets cold. <laughs> what is wrong with this little flying thing, bro? Mm
starts that our shift is set for every morning, and we're free to do whatever we want all afternoon. But it seems like most of the other inmates choose to continue working through the afternoon to earn more credit coupons. Oh, and they also said that you can use coupons to skip work in the morning and free up your time. They weren't kidding. Credit coupons really can be used to do anything here. Ah! Oh, Paimon's so tired. And we'll need to wake up and go to work in the morning. Without any credit coupons, it's not like we can really do anything else. Hmm. Nighty night, Traveler. Paimon hopes we can keep making progress on our investigation tomorrow. Hey, Phoenix, how are you, bro? Is... that even possible? Unless... it wasn't an ordinary dream? Oh, child's vision! So, you had it with you this whole time? Maybe the vision connected child's consciousness to I'm yours! I'm good, bro. Just a slight headache today. Well, I'm still trying to like get through the story and stuff. Good thing you brought the vision with you here. So what did you see in the dream? Do you know where child went? <clears throat> huh. Okay. Well, hopefully it'll be a bit more helpful in the future. What's more important now is that it's the start of another new day as prisoners. Let's What's the plan for today? Nah, I'm pretty sure I slept good. But I don't know, man. I was probably cold. Because I didn't sleep, like, in a sheet or anything. Or a blanket. But it's been really hot here. So that's why I don't sleep in, like, a blanket or anything. Let's go! Kinda it's weird. time to start working. I don't know the how to explain it. The catches us skulking about. He's sure to give us an earful. I'm studying like crazy and I have to study again. Yeah, Look bro. Look who decided to show up. Get your butts you in gear and get to work. Tomorrow, right? Time's a wasted. The time required to complete Act 3 and 4. Stop again sometime. All right, man. All the best for your studies, bro. They have Good. Tomorrow. Here you go. All right, Remember bro. to give, give me, me the sec. widget once you've finished processing it.
Alright, I'm back. Yeah, Phoenix, all the best for your studies, bro. Got your exams come. Wait, Hydro, aren't you? Oh, wait, I forgot you're in college, right? So you're not doing the same exams. Yeah, I heard that, um... Wasn't you who said that this is the longest... The longest act or something? I don't mind, though. Because after the story is done, like, I have nothing to do, right? More than just, like, exploration. I'm kind of uh, curious to see what's going to happen. To learn about the Hydro Archon or whatever, but... I'm also not, like, in a rush to end the story. Hello, shift mates. I saw you finished your work, so I thought I'd come over and say hi. Oh, hey there. We've seen you before. Your assigned workspace is really close, isn't it? <laughs> That's right. The name's Rowan. This past few days, I couldn't help but notice the new faces working nearby. I guess we were destined to meet. I've been working here for almost 15 years. Even the foreman, Grainville, always calls me chief. Whoa, you've been working here a long time, Chief. You can't do it for four hours. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> If there's anything you'd like to know, just ask me. I just do what I production zone better than I just do what I hand. do, bro, until like I get tired of it, I go do something Chief, else. It's pretty much how it works for me. Did you just ask about the rules? <laughs> pretty sharp for newcomers. You've already heard about the rules, huh? Who'd you hear it from? Hmm. All right. Seeing as I'm the one who came over here, you're already calling me Chief. I guess I can tell you a little. Truth is, you two keep working like this, you might be putting yourselves in danger. Huh? Wait, there's even a rule about that? What would have happened if you never told us about this? Well, it's usually not that easy to break one on accident. The conditions of the hidden rules are usually pretty specific. But once you do break one, bad things happen. If you work continuously in the production zone for three days, and if all you do besides eating and sleeping is just work, then something bad will happen during lunch on the third day. Huh? Like what? Oh, don't scare Greymine! <laughs> if I knew that, then I wouldn't be standing here talking to you, now would I? You mean, even you have never tried working three days like that before? There's actually a legend about this rule. They say that there was a worker who worked way harder than me. He was both efficient and eager on the job, and most other workers couldn't hold a candle to him. One time, he tried to test his limits and worked as long as he could. Then during lunch on the third day, he disappeared into thin air, as if he'd evaporated. Later, some people went and asked some of his past friends about him, but they said, never heard of the guy. Unfortunately, we were assigned different production zones. I never saw for myself what he looked like. Wait, are you thinking that it was... Huh? Oh? You... <sighs> Listen, kid. This ain't the kind of thing you should be curious about. Let me tell you, you're better off forgetting about it and looking after yourself. Now I kind of regret ever telling you. Yeah, I agree with Chief here. Do you really want to try? <sighs> Alright, if you insist. Oh, 
just a regular meal set. Guess Paimon shouldn't get her hopes up. What would you like to do this afternoon? But Paimon really hopes the foreman will be in a better mood today. Look who decided to show up. Get your butts in gear and get to work. Time's a-wasting. Good, here you go. Remember to give me the widget once you've finished processing it. Let me have a look. Hmm, not bad. Right, here's your credit coupons. Ah, we woke up so early today that Paimon's been nodding off all afternoon. Good thing it's finally time for bed. Right, we just need to keep at it. Look who decided to show up. Get your butts in gear and get to work. Time's a wasting. Oh? What's with suddenly wanting to work so hard? You need coupons that badly? Sh sure. Let's just say we really want to test our limits. Today. Let's keep it up! Ooh, Paimon's had it. Who knew that processing these widgets would be so tiring? It. Paimon doesn't even have the energy to talk anymore. Is it time to eat yet? Grumbling the whole time. Let's just eat already. Paimon wonders what we'll get today. Maybe we'll get the super lucky meal. Wait, what? Well, what in the world is this? What's with Paimon's food? And yours is the same. Is this stuff meat? But it looks and feels so bizarre. Would make food like this. <laughs> <laughs> 
going on? Is this the bad thing that Rowan was talking about? No, stop right there. Paimon gets what you mean, just don't say it! Hey, isn't that Wolsey over there? He must have made the food, right? So let's just ask him about the food and be done with it! Hey, Wolsey! Have a moment? Hmm? What is it? I'm about to go report the numbers for today's free meal, so you'd better make it quick. Uh, it's about the meat in our meals. Look! Does it seem... normal to you? The meat? Oh, that. Looks perfectly fine to me. Totally normal. You better hurry up and shout out. Uh, how could this be fun? Hey, don't leave! You barely even looked at it! Hey! Ugh, what should we do now? Wolsey wouldn't even give us the time of day. <sighs> Is he trying? Yeah, looks like we have no other choice. Paima was positively famished a minute ago, but now she's lost her appetite. What would you like to do this afternoon? Since we have time now, let's focus on investigating some more. Hey, Hattie, what's up, bro? Are you, bro? Did you finish your Sumero story?
You have to go to the domain, um, Hadi and, uh, fuck, dude, everything rolled into defense, man, it's crazy. It happened with your heart of the flower, dude. I can't believe I rolled on this and like everything went into um defense, bro. That is disgusting. I'm going to use this one and see what I get when I roll on it. Defense bro, you see that shit? Defense, HP defense. That is tragic. this bro I'm doing good how are you doing Serban how's your Sunday man there are too many artifacts you need to write 15 recipes How's it going? Did you already start? It just started now. It's already 6.43. Yeah, but the even is still early, right? 15 recipes for your kind of test. Yeah, yeah, healing skills and HP. I know her healing... Uh, dude, uh, it shouldn't like most healers heal on HP. Most of the healers do not scale on HP, is that what you're saying? Yes, yeah, everyone, just get to work, man. Really? 
Did you get that from the request or exploring the chest on the map? What, the Favonius lands? You get this from Wishing, I guess. I think. Of course, Serban. Of course, man. Thank you for stopping by today, bro. All the best on your recipes. Take care, alright? Okay, Hydro, thank you, sir. Jan-Yun. Jan Yun's a healer? I had no idea. I want the uh, Traveler's Resonation. Which vision is the best? Okay. Yeah, everyone says it's uh, Dendro, bro. Traveler's talents. Uh, which one? Want to see this? Pardon. Select skill attributes. Like, you want to see the entire details? <sighs> oh, 
for each talent. All right. Uh, I'm gonna click on it, then do that. Give me a sec, guys. Alright, I'm back. Good. I should have, uh... Oh wait, I was doing something. Alright. So we were looking at... All right, that makes sense, Hydro. Wait, did I just get energy recharge on this? Oh, it's uh, upgrading the energy recharge, okay.
Mic is not right, let me see. What did you say you want, Addy? Sands of Eon. I have no idea where you get those, bro. Oh, hello. You two are the ones who were with His Grace. No need to be so nervous. Sorry, I couldn't help but think of His Grace once I saw you, and I... Oh, well, it's hard to say. Maybe I am. He's got a very overwhelming presence. It makes me feel like I'm just some insignificant little bug. Wait, seriously? Oh, well, I'm always indecisive, and I tend to make a mess of things. It's like a reflex. I just instantly start to tense up the moment I... What? F please don't say anything like that out loud. How could you possibly think something like that? Hydro, on a world level six, how many um heroes wit do you get from the ley lines? in my resin on the ley lines, bro. Twenty four K per challenge. I guess I'll have to just wait and just like upgrade slowly. I guess I'll have to like open like treasure boxes and shit bro and exploration to get that stuff and do like the events. I'm getting held back right now by Mora and uh, Heroes with Can't upgrade my characters, man. What's the highest world level? Oh, wonderful. I was worried that you'd be busy trying to earn credit coupons all the time, but it seems like you haven't neglected your investigation work after all. Paimon likes having more coupons, but no one wants to work all the time. Have you also been investigating the area, Lynette? No, I was just slacking off, and you happened to catch me. My brother is still obsessed with anything remotely related to the Forbidden Zone. But knowing him, it won't be long before we get more leads. Oh, before I forget, this is for you. Huh? Credit coupons? Why are you giving us these? I've been here longer than you, so credit coupons aren't a resource in particularly short supply. What is in short supply are interesting people to talk with. Aw, that's so nice of you, Lynette. We'll be sure to make good use of these coupons then. Thanks a bunch!
All right, sorry about that. I'm back. Mm. Huh? Rowan? Uh, what are you doing here, Chief? Oh, uh, I was injured a bit just now. Nothing major. I think I just pulled something. A little mishaps like this are unavoidable at work, you know? Experienced as the chief would still get hurt on the job. I just knew you would say that. This is pretty embarrassing. Uh, where is Siegeween when you need her anyway? The one time I need to make a quick trip to the infirmary. Oh, you mean she wasn't in the infirmary? Yeah. The rumors say that there's never anybody in the infirmary in the half hour before lunch, and nobody knows where Siegeween gets off to. really strange. Seedreen's always super dedicated to her work. Where else would she possibly go? <sighs> Forget it. I can take care of a small sprain like this on my own anyway. No need to trouble her. It's not necessarily difficult when your when your characters are built for it. If I should go on world level eight right now, it would be difficult for me, cause my characters aren't even level ninety, much less upgraded to to fight the monsters that are scaled for that world. It's not about how the characters are leveled up. I am pretty sure the damage they do and the uh, and the health they have are scaled based on the world level. It's not that I can't play on it, it's just that it's going to be a little more time consuming when I fight them. Hey! It's the traveler in Paimon! <laughs> no need to tease me, okay? I won't trip on the same step twice. Just like His Grace said, paying attention to every little detail is the key to prosperity. Hmm. Maybe this is the true meaning of rebirth, not just earning credit coupons. I was doing the level, uh, the level 88 um, dungeon the other day to get the, the talent upgrade books, right? And it's not like they said that my characters weren't that strong, but I mean I still beat it But it just took a little longer than I was supposed to. That's it I'd rather to have like my dad and skill for that world what are you doing in the production This zone? is the character I was talking about dude. This character is uh, Hello, half Amazon half human. This is now. weird we don't have any patients to look after in the infirmary. I thought I'd come here and enjoy the sight of everyone hard at work. Enjoy? Oh, uh, what's there to enjoy here? It's really worth watching. I often stand here and observe everyone. Humans are just so interesting and adorable. I like to watch your expressions while you work. Uh, are you talking about pets or people? Oh, I can see why you think that, but you shouldn't jump to conclusions. See, we Melazines are a different species, 
And we see the world very differently from humans. It's very easy for me to observe everyone's condition. Half All it takes is one look, and I can tell which workers are exhausted. Wait, Melusine's can see that? Huh, that does sound useful for being a nurse. <sighs> yes, running around tending to everyone's health is very fulfilling. But I'd much prefer it if you're all happy and free from exhaustion and pain in the first place. Take care of your body. Make sure you eat well. Always rest when you're tired from work and don't push yourself too hard. We'll definitely take care of ourselves. Thanks for the reminder. You said when you got to World Level 8, the game became a Dark Souls game? That's crazy, man. This man said he had to learn attack patterns. And utilize each one of his characters properly. I'm pretty sure that's only because we don't have any C6 characters, man. You have like C6 uh, units, bro. We're level 7, but a bit hard for it. Yeah, as long as you, you have like C6 units, man, you can like one shot everything, bro. notebook that suspicious guy peeking into the infirmary just now is he a fan of sea dream he must have dropped this let paimon read it real quick the melody perceived the world very differently from humans there are significant deviations as a result their sense of aesthetics and beauty is also very different from that of humans this must be taken into consideration when giving gifts. Whoa, this all sounds pretty serious. He sure did his homework. And as for the notebook, let's take it.
okay. You should rest up. We'll be back at it tomorrow. So after working a few days straight, we got some strange meat in our lunch. What was that all about? Hmm... Has our investigation turned up anything useful recently? Really? <sighs> then it looks like that part of the investigation has hit a dead end. Well, we'll keep searching for more clues tomorrow. Good night, Traveler. Maybe we can make some progress in our investigation today. What do you have planned for us? After working here so long, we're really starting to get the hang of it. But doing the same thing all the time can get old pretty quickly. How are you holding up? Yeah, it's good to kick back and relax once in a while. I don't think they have to reflect Hydro. The game actually tell them where they're weak. Dude, I keep hearing those boxes, dude. Where do I get those? Oh, just a regular meal set. Guess Paimon shouldn't get her hopes up. What would you like to do this afternoon? Knowing child, he must have been there all the time. Grab yourself a oh, look at this, dude. Training guide. Look at this. Look at my team. Formidable, truly reliable. A bit weak. Try leveling up. Enhance. Character level. Weapon. Artifact. Character talents. See that? The game tell you what to do now. Yeah, the quest that force you to do single player is really annoying. Oh, look at this. Game literally tell you what to do. Oh, your character is weak? Just look in here. You need to level up your characters with these stuff. Get your weapon up. Get your artifacts, bro. Level up your artifacts. Then get your character talents. You just need to go in your menu, bro, and go to training guide. That's where you need to go. And that's not the only place. When you're in dungeons, if you fail the dungeon, the dungeon will literally tell you at the end that you're kind of weak. You need to upgrade this. This game is not like when it released in 2020, man. It is... It is very easy now. That's why, like, if you say anything in this game is difficult, bro, it's a joke, man. It didn't mean by character strength alone, but how they should fight depend on the type of enemies in they encounter. Yeah, but the game literally tell you how to fight the mob, how to fight everything now. It's not like before, bro. Where you had to figure it out. <sighs> look at the look at Aleph for example, the electro hypostasis. Back when we used to do that fight, 
it would regenerate its HP, and people didn't know why, right? But now when you're fighting it, as soon as you get it into the state where it splits apart, the game will literally say, use elemental attacks and attack the thing so it doesn't recover its HP. It literally you tells you now. Today's commissions. The Here rookies I train are pretty much don't care about enemies, they're itching to fight. So, that's, uh, that's another way of saying someone is stupid, bro. Welcome. How can you fight if you don't understand what you're fighting? Bring Zongli. Imagine you go with Zongli and you still die. That would just make you look like a joke, bro, to be honest. We can't defend stupidity, man. Hey, Adonis, how are you, bro? Defeat a Geo Hypostasis in single player. Defeat the Animal Hypostasis. I don't need to defeat them. I mean, why not? Let me go do that real quick. I don't even remember how to fight them, but I guess I'll figure it out while I'm doing it. You're training your rookies to teach how to get over their stupidity. Well, that makes sense. It, if you had said that from the start, then I would understand. If you were like, if you told me in despair, like, the people I train, they don't pay attention, right? They, you don't even have to say they're stupid. You're just say they don't pay attention. And I try to train them to, so they can pay attention, right? Because they're fighting things and they don't understand how the bosses work. Or they're fighting monsters and they don't understand how the monsters work, right? You say pay attention to attacks and dodge them. If you have this, the right character, you don't even have to dodge the attacks. If you're using like a, a Zhongli with a god level shield, right? You don't necessarily have to dodge anything, bro. If you're using uh, characters that generate shields, you don't have to dodge every attack, man. You can literally just stay there, stay there, spam shields and just spam attacks, spam elemental reactions. That's why we are, that's why I was saying that when you said you have to pay attention to the patterns and dodge them, I'm like, that's only because you don't have even like C6 characters, because if you have like a C6 character, bro, you don't even have to do anything in this game. I saw a rookie having level 20 units charging against a level 30 enemy without a proper setup. <laughs> And when you're actually at level 20, you die really fast, bro. How do I fight this thing again? Wait. Let me change my... What do I need? Eh, I'll just fight him with this. Let's see how stupid I am, bro. See if I remember how it's done. No one say anything in the chat, bro. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, wait, wait. Let me leave, let me leave, let me leave. No, no, no one say anything in the chat. Don't say anything in the chat, bro. Delete your messages. As soon as I saw those pillars, I remember I need a great sword. <laughs> Is it even possible to do this fight without a character with a great sword, bro? As soon as I saw the pillars, I remember what I'm supposed to. But they attack, they attack you so many Archon quests is boring. When you're doing the part where you keep resetting for a day, it's boring, yeah? Dude, none of my Greatsword characters are... I think if they get one hit, they die. Lands at Hyper Boom with Noel. Bro, it's not even possible to, to fight this thing without a greatsword, right? You have two greatsword units? Yeah, but they don't have a level, dude. They're level one. I think when the pillars come up, they 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 have a they make like a a pulse, right? Let's jam. Where if you get hit by it, you die. Alright, let's try it. Let's see what happens. 
I know you can probably break them without a great sword, but I don't know, man. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah, it attacks you while you're doing this. that it's standing on so it um it falls on the ground oh i have to break this right here i remember that part no what the this actually protects us That's what I was saying, Hydro. I love to try and um, I'll do it in a smart way, I guess. Power core. I have to try and break it when it's not attacking. Oh yeah, it breaks its own thing. I'm gonna wait until it come back to this one. Is go Barbara go? <laughs> I wanted to come back to this one. All right, you know what? I'll just go and break uh, the other one. Like weaken this one in the meantime. on yeah but it... I was watching it to see if it was going to move that's why I was getting the other ones weak just in case it didn't or just in case like if I start working on this one and then it decides to move Now we have the others weak, right? Yeah, I did it the first time. Can't break that in time. That does a shit ton of damage, bro. Said, go, 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 go. to assist in the bloom reaction
moving around, bro. It's so annoying. Let's dance. Bro, what you guys are explaining is literally what I do every day. I'm surprised you don't remember. Why am I even doing this right now? Uh, that is exactly what I explained to you, Hydro. That that's all. And you said you recommend I go farm this artifact. I don't know, man. I'll be back. Give me a second. Give me a few minutes.
All right, I'm back. Uh. Well, if it's not one thing, it's the other, man. Give me a second when I'm on a call. Yeah, there's set talk of some people. That's my fault. I think I should be good now. Uh, Alright, thank you for the welcome back. Jingcho, I don't have Jingcho. So I use Barbara to do exactly what you were explaining before, right? But um, I do it in specific situations, right? But that is exactly how I play the game. It was better if you asked me this fear. Because that's how I usually do it. I use the Dendro and um, main character, switch to Barbara, get the blooms, and then I use Zhongling to make them explode, right? Um, Hydro, no. That's why I was like so confused why Hydro was repeating it in the chat. Because Hydro, no, I know. Like, why are you doing that, bro? It was kind of annoying, to be honest. Why are you to farm the deep wood? Yes, I farmed the deep wood. I was farming the deep wood earlier. And um I don't want to build Jing Cho. I know he's in the shop. But to get him from the shop I need to I need to wish on the banner. I'm not going to use any of my wishes until Farina gets here. Farina is going to be my main hydro character. And then I'll figure out who's going to be my main electro character after that. But I'm saving everything for Furina. You know this, this bear. I was talking about this, this yesterday. I don't want to build a, a Jing Cho. If, well, if I get him now, I probably would. But I don't want to, like, focus too much resource. I'm focusing on building my main set of characters first. Currently, I'm doing it my main four. I'm slowly building four more. So I can probably go do some Spiral Abyss in the meantime. <sighs> I don't have enough to buy him, no. I had 12, but I actually used some to buy some materials. 
He needs 36. I'm not going to wish on any banners to get that. Limited card in this way on my showcase. Uh, listen, Dragon Ball theme on background and do an Archon quest. Please save my sanity. Dragon Ball? Yo, that is godlike Adonis. New Blade and Kazo are hype. Yeah, you, I know you guys are all hype for that. <laughs> For those characters, but I won't be wishing on that banner. I will stay committed. Me and me and Phoenix decided we're going to stay committed to get the, the princess. Oh, this is dangerous. C6 is the only way to save for her. I'll take whatever I get to be honest. I know it's not going to be C0. I know that for a fact. him yet I, I did plan to before but then no the, the way I should say is that everyone was recommending that I do an event right to get him back when I first started playing but I didn't do the event I was focusing on the main story so the event passed and now he's gone so the only way to get him is to buy him Elemental Master. C2 is overpowered. So if you have enough to buy it, and give 200 elemental mastery. Got C3 is Jing Cho. You wish on the standard. Yeah, I know Jing Cho is really good. Fishing for who's F2P weapon. I'm not going to do any fishing out of this. I don't have the, the patience for it. For for you know have a F2P weapon like Raiden. Nah, I'm probably just going to wish for the signature or something. Forge two four star weapons. I'm just going to get the signature weapon or something. Wait, did I leave my 
exactly. I wish you all the best, man. You said you have 200 wishes. Are you still farming primos? Come with me. Let's pick some matutake. People said I need to forge two, um... I know which two weapon. I'm going to... Hydra, I'm actually going to take your advice right now. And forge that weapon that you mentioned. I just didn't do it yet because I didn't really like... Have the... Uh... You said iron sting, right? I need to buy one more of this. I didn't have the resources to upgrade it, really. That's why I haven't... Uh, put it on the traveler yet, but he will get this weapon Yeah, Hydro said it's the best weapon for him if you want to forge one I heard that the one that you get at the end of the Aranara quest is also good. I read it. It seems like it's really good, but I don't think I want to do the, even if I should do the, yeah, Iron Sing for Denjo. Even if I, sh I should um, do the r, r quest, it wouldn't be anytime soon. Race you. Yeah, Iron Sting because uh, it gives you elemental mastery. You build it for Bennett? Yeah, I need the Elemental Master and the Traveler. Wait, I already bought it? I need Energy Recharge. For Dendro Traveler? I don't know, man. I know for now he's going to be... He's going to get a lot of Elemental Master as well. But naturally he'll get that, I guess. It depends on what I get on my um, substats. I'll probably get it on the substats. For... For... um. The piece, what is it? The goblet? Let me double check it. Artifacts. For the goblet, he, I will make sure he has Dendro damage bonus still. Elemental recharge hungry. Yeah, but I'm probably going to just make it be on the substats really. I bought two of these, so why do I only why did I only have one? That makes no sense. I were they saying I can't afford it in Leeway. At least 220 to be safe for energy recharge. <laughs> that is godlike, bro. <laughs> that means I'd have to get energy recharge on the goblet. I really just want him to get that extra dendro damage, bro. I mean, he will be support, so you guys are probably right. So we'll figure it out when we're actually, like, looking for godlike artifacts. Because Zhang Zhangling is probably going to be my main DPS. Well, not probably. She is going to be my main DPS. My team is going to be consistent with um the free-to-play characters. You're not going to see too many, like, godlike. I'm just going to get three on the team as my main Hydro character for the, the Bloom. Hey, uh, hey Phoenix, welcome back, bro. How was the studies, man? Sold out? Dude, why do... Wait, what? I bought two of these. What did I use it to make? Oh, wait, we got books? Bro, this is huge. 15k, I can't waste 15k, man. His damage output is mostly from the burst. Yeah, pretty much. 
going fine. Yeah, dude. I'll be here taking breaks and getting snacks, man. Artifacts is full. I just used up a lot of my artifacts. Most of my artifacts, really. To upgrade uh, the new ones I put on the Traveler. I put two new pieces on him. I put on the this one. Labyrinth Wayfarer. Or a part of the deep wood, and I put on this one. And I was also upgrading um, Yao Yao as well, so I put on her artifacts as well. Again, I'm gonna do a long study session again today. Yeah, bro, just make sure this time, bro, I would recommend make sure you get some rest before you go to the exams, man. I don't want you dying over there. No coffee, man. Kai is a good F2P character. What do you mean, um, Adonis? Kaya is built. Kaya is my main cryo character. What do you mean, bro? Yeah, this morning, uh, Forrest hopped in. Helped me farm a level 90. That man came in with the god Jongli and the god Nuvolet, man. We just destroyed some level 90 dungeons, bro. I just dropped the flower for the bloom. And used Jongling to, to get the the blooms when he uses well he was using new village so he was already getting the blooms right but i use jungling to help with the explosion and the vaporize you should see that the first part of the video of phoenix it was pretty good we had fun man we were like running through the dungeon in seconds dude i i know i had two of these i'm pretty sure i didn't use any wait unless i Unless I have one still. Let me double check. I probably still have it. I do. I have three of them. Dude, then why is the game trolling me? <laughs> Wait, where's the smith? You should swap Pavonia's Lance on Yao Yao for Zhongling. Zhongling is my main DPS, Adonis. Dude, I was supposed to do it yesterday, man, but then... Adonis, we're going to keep the the whatever the what the white tassel on jungling, all right? But where's the sword? Oh, here it is. Wait, what? Northlander sword billet isn't fab good on jungling? Yeah. Can we stop with the backseating, please, guys? If I wanted her on energy recharge, I would have put it on her a long time ago. Oh, this is the Claymore one. How did I not realize that? Bro, my brain is not working. Let's go to Inazuma and see if we can buy it. Even though I don't think I have anything from Inazuma. No, I need to make two four-star weapons. But I was just going to like uh, get a refinement for the Iron Sting. That's what I'm trying to do. Where is this? Where do I even buy it? Where's the jewelry store? Oh, it's up ahead. In order for the bountiful core to be triggered. 
What is Niloy? I made a one one iron sting earlier, Phoenix. Do I need to do a quest to buy things from these people? The fuck, what is this? You see me not red marks anymore? On my achievements? I didn't collect my achievements, what do you mean? You still have the red marks, bro. In order for the Bountiful Core to be triggered. Yeah, I just, I just, I'm confused why he would say that because I don't have Nilo and he knows I don't have Nilo. Where can I get a Northlander um, sword billet? Can I try Sumeru? But you buy them from the, the, the jeweler, right? This is so annoying. Domains? Wait, you can get the... Oh, wait, you might be right. Let me check. Let me check. I've ordered a keyboard and mouse. Send me. Give me a sec. Give me a sec, I'm grabbing some food real quick. All right, I'm back. I was starving. I asked uh, my dad to make something, so we just did. If there's nothing better to do, we could go foraging for ingredients. <laughs> I don't even know what buttons I'm pressing. <laughs> The hardest weekly boss is the Raiden Shogun. Yeah, the Raiden Shogun boss fight is pretty fun. Let's give me a sec, let me eat two sandwiches, bro. I'm starving. Have a good night, bro. Take care.
Who's the easiest weekly boss in Genshin? Decide whether pyro slimes taste better with salt and pepper or garlic and herbs. Yeah, the Valen is the the easiest one. <laughs> At least for me. The Raiden Shogun is pretty hard, bro. Alright. If you're talking about the Sumeru story, Adonis, you're not going to fight anytime soon. If there's nothing better to do, we could go foraging for ingredients. The only region that you need to do the story to get to is in Azuma Despair. Everywhere else, you can go everywhere else, as whenever you want. Yeah, you can do that. But I went to Fontaine different than you guys. The story took me to Fontaine. Like, they just teleported me there. I didn't walk there. You didn't know it was accessible? Yeah, every country except Inazuma. Inazuma is the only uh, uh, place you need uh, to do the story to come to. Currently, I don't know about the other nations. Maybe when they put out the other regions like Snez, Snaya or whatever, it will be a little bit more complicated.
there's nothing better to do, we could go foraging for ingredients. So I this happened a really long time ago this year. If there's nothing better to do, we could go foraging for ingredients. <clears throat> All right, we should be good now for the end of the stream. Well, until the end of the stream. them to when I can despair especially like if they will take like a minute to kill for example the ruined hunters or the ruined guards you're running past then they just draw aggro for no reason which is annoying supposed to do again I was going to go to the blacksmith right they need me to forge another uh, four-star weapon I <laughs> said he's gonna cut his wooden piece all right sir <laughs> They won't let you do that though. They'll start shooting rockets, bro. What is this? <laughs> I'll probably just make this since I used to use the Mona back in the day. Dude, you know, let me tell you about one who is more annoying. Yeah, you know what? Let me ask you. Who is more annoying than the ruined guard, bro? In the open world when you're trying to avoid them. Make a wild guess, bro.
For you, the Ruin Hunter. For me, dude, is the fucking abyss mages, man. <laughs> dude, when you're running, they just start teleporting and follow behind you, man. It's so annoying. They teleport exactly where you are. Clear spell up is 5 to 3. Well, 5 3. Equip two characters with four piece sets of minimum four star. Yes, <laughs> unlock 15 shrine of the depth. Hmm, I have to look for them though. All right, you know, let's go do the spiral abyss, bro. <laughs> And this is just me like trying to avoid what you call it the story for a minute i want to do something more exciting man let's go do this for a bit do five three when characters create geo constructs We need pyro on one floor. Uh, what is this? Hydro on the other floor. The new one? Yeah, but I'm, I'm not like at the end. I'm not in the deep abyss. I'm trying to do the first four first. I stopped because I didn't have two teams, but I'll probably just transplant my teams. Just to clear it so I can get the primos or whatever from the book. From my um handbook. This floor will be normal, just annoying dudes. Then the Sissin Mage, and then Fatui. So we need pyro characters on this floor. Hmm, I think I can figure something out. <coughs> Barbara is going to be on the second floor for sure. So maybe go traveler. Uh, maybe make. Let's make Zhongling take care of things on this floor, right? You haven't done it either. You haven't done it at all. Aren't you like AR fifty five, bro? Wait, let me let me level Yao Yao a little more. Just a little more. What is this? Danger hypostasis. Interesting. Alright, we'll have to use a level 4 here, yeah. um Yao Yao. This man said he is the completionist nightmare. Since we already have this floor at three stars, I think I can get away with uh maybe Zhongling and Yao Yao. Let's see. I think we can get away with Zhongling and Yao Yao, bro. So we're gonna make Zhongling the main DPS for this floor. Let's Yao Yao's gonna be last. Let's bring uh uh, uh Kaya is useless, maybe Lisa. Hey Phoenix, welcome back, bro. Lisa. Lynette. Yao Yao. Him, her, maybe him and her. I think. <laughs> nah, the first floor needs uh, stronger characters on it, man. I'll probably put Amber. I'll get rid of her and put Amber on the first floor. Is 
Zhongling and Amber. Uh, maybe her. her. This floor we'll do Traveler. Traveler. Him. Uh, maybe Lynette. Him. I'm not going to use... These characters are just fillers. I'm not going to use them a lot. Damn, this team looks weak, man. But we'll be fine. Let's see what happened. <clears throat> Give the figure to the end current. Character max HP is plus 25%. Uh, attack. Let's do more attack. Yeah, let's try this. I think we can do it with this. Depends on how many enemies, though. Up a little. We need to kill this guy. As long as we kill these guys, we should be fine. Let's use her, drop that. prison bro come on man oops uh let's hope we can keep it keep it up bro this floor is actually going to be free Oh, I didn't bring a... Oh, it's fine. Let the show begin. We're, we're fine, we're fine. Uh, I need him to teleport over here, though. Oh, so sad. Cool it. DPS Razor. <clears throat> yeah, Razor would be good, but Razor has to be the DPS. Yeah. Let's see. Character charge attack, stamina consumption is 50% less. That's actually good. Character damage when it's a sprint. Let's do less uh, stamina consumption. So I can move around more. New job. They're attacking the wrong person. No Get them! Come on, sir. Come on, sir. 
Set, but he is he's just our stuff by other characters. <laughs> All right, this time we'll do this. Oh, that dude threw fire on my ship, bro. Come on, man. Will be frozen in time. Oh, it's going to explode because they're all pyro, I think. Oh wait. Oh, this is good. 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 Let the show begin. I don't have a what you call it pyro character. Fine. Dodge this. Let the magic begin. Hyper Bloom is the best thing to exist in Genshin, bro. It's broken, man. Ah, uh, a new job. Usually, it's. Uh... Another test subject. <laughs> oh, that is hilarious, man. Character Noma charge attack damage is plus 20 20%. I'll use that. I will start with Yao Yao maybe. Oh damn. We have to kill we have to kill her as fast as, as possible, bro. Because she is really annoying. said hyper bloom lisa <laughs> what are you <laughs> wait you guys gonna... yeah that that is really annoying man guess what no i don't have any imagine never seen that dude that died that dude died without even doing anything yo you saw that Now we can leave. I just needed this, bro. Wait, huh? You get 300 primos for getting 9 stars? Interesting. So we'll need to be ready for floor six next. This is why I did it. We needed that. I got a wish. Unlock 15 shrines of the depths. Equip two character with four star artifacts. Did Zhongling not have all 4-star artifacts? <sighs> yeah, I think I did some pull yesterday as well, man. I did like maybe 5. Bakingo? I don't... I don't know that one. Hey, 
Hey, Lofi. Hey, AB. What's up, bro? How are you guys doing today? Wait, equip two characters with four piece sets of minimum four star artifacts. Okay. So in other words, let me see something. I need it to be like a full four piece set, man. Maybe I can just borrow this real quick. I don't think so. Should you leave this stream because you're unlucky? I mean, I was lucky today, man. I might ju you might just get some of the luck here, bro. I just need her. I just need the character to have a four, uh, a full four-piece set. Was that lucky? I pull. I got on my first pull in a dungeon this morning. I got a really good artifact. I was doing the dungeon with um with forest, and I got I got this right. I got HP, crit rate, crit damage, and attack right. So seeing this at the start was really lucky, bro. But guess what? The thing is, when I rolled, everything went into defense, bro. That was disgusting. When I was upgrading, everything went into defense, right? And I also got another piece, which is this one. I got both of these at the same time, which is attack, crit rate, crit damage, and energy recharge. Yeah, the despair, you were here, man. It's pretty disgusting, bro. Everything went into fucking defense, man. And then I got this piece. This piece is godlike, bro, but, you know, I'm not going to use that right now. Decide whether pyro slimes taste better with salt and pepper or garlic and herb. Now we need to unlock 15 Shrine of the Depths. I need to get two more. Let me check what keys I have. I have Monsad Shrines, right? I only have keys for a Monsad? That's crazy. I don't think I'll, I unlock this one here. Let's try the one down here. What do you mean, please? I'm not going to Lofi. And I 
ask the stream not to do any back seating, Loki, so no back seating today, dude. Oh, I'm not ready to collect them. We need one more. I think I got that more than likely. I got this one. I'm not sure about this one. Maybe I did. I don't know. Give me a sec, guys. Which of these I'm more likely not to collect? Not even sure. I'll check this one here on the hill. Chill when you fail to get her the first time. So are you ready for her on the sec on the rerun? But wait, this pair, aren't you going for Kazuha, bro? There's so many good characters coming up back to back. This is what I'm telling you about them being manipulative, man. This is what we talked about yesterday, this pair. Because they're putting Kazuha and Nuvlet on the same banner. Like, how would why would you do that to, to your fan base, man? And you know they want both of them. They can't choose. And then Farina is coming immediately after. You must start exploring too. To get as much. We are going to. Uh, we're almost done with the story bro. But. I have been proactive man. You know that I got this area. I'm pretty done with. um With Mondstadt right. And look over here in Liyue. Did Bishui planes up to 78%. And here the estuary to 72%, right? So I only have Minlin left and Lisha in these uh two areas, right? And then look at this. We got all of Cheng Yu, bro. We got all of Cheng Yu. If I can't get her again, I'll wait for the next banner. Bro, you are so patient, man. I respect you, man. I respect the patience, bro, 100%. Unfortunately for me, I have to get her the first time. It's a must. <laughs> Who are you pulling for, Phoenix? Aren't you going for Kazuha too? Like Loki? What is a 50-50? When you're when the character when you get to the your hard pity If the character you don't get 
there is a possibility of you getting the character that is on the banner or a different character. That's a 50-50. So if you get the character that's on the banner, it means you won the 50-50. If you didn't, it means you lost it and you got someone else. But the next character is guaranteed to be the one that's on the banner. Did that patience is learned. The other two games I play use FOMO Tactic 2. Yeah, I remember you saying that, bro. Dude, why do I have 15 keys and I can't find what I'm looking for? Well, I have three keys. Let me check. Let me check here. Yeah, I can see I've opened the one on the hill there. Let me go get this viewpoint real quick. That's Salt Spring, bro. The main reason I'm doing this, Phoenix, is because I'm getting primos, right? I'm getting a lot of primos, bro. You build your Zhongling about 4,000 damage. Congrats, man. It's uh, it's four years of experience that same tactic for me. Yeah, bro. That, that patience is something else, man. See this, um, Phoenix? We get 150 here. Chapter 9. Let's go, bro. Farm an XP, man. By the time I do the Ascension Quest, I might be AR50. I'm just joking, though. Now, let's see. And that's 8 5 star artifacts on level 20. Only did 3. That Alright, so this can wait. And then do Spell of the 6 3. Unlock 18 Shrine of the Depths. Yeah, that would be in a different nation, I think. The one good thing that came out of all of that is that I got books to upgrade her, to ascend on um, Yao Yao. But I have to go fight this thing. That sounds good, bro. I'm glad to hear that. So Kaya is now level 80. We don't have to worry about him. His talents are, are 265. Right, we just need to get this to 6. And then we're done with Kaya. Zhongling is good. Traveler is good. We just need to get barbs up. Yeah, dude, what you saw in the abyss a while with Kaya was not pretend, bro. Kaya is strong now. We only need to change the weapon to something that grants him more energy recharge. Is this a Favonia sword? 
crit damage. Harbinger of Dawn. Okay. We need him to ha to be on something that gives him energy recharge, bro. But I haven't even like put artifacts on him yet. So we got our work. Yeah, I made it for the, the, the Dendro Traveler Phoenix. I think to finish off today, we might just go fight the Dendro Hypostasis. Uh, we farmed some this morning. I don't know, man. I'll probably ascend. Maybe, maybe I'll do a session with, um, I can do some alone, or maybe if Forrest wants to come in and we go farm some, we can do that. Because he loves to use, um, Grandpa to destroy things, man. You still use Kai as the main DPS, bro? That's godlike, bro. Where's the the dendro hypostasis? But oh, there it is. I need to kill this thing. But it's underground. I've never fought it before, so I don't know what to expect from it. All right, Phoenix, take care, bro. All the best with your studies, man. I pray for your success, bro. And make sure you get some rest and something to eat and drink while you're studying. I'm more interested in building the underdogs rather than my Nubia and Navia. Dude, come on, man. If I had Navia, there's no way I wouldn't build her. But you sound just like me. This man said, Nahida is main DPS. Bro, we know how much you love your Nahida, bro. <laughs> we know how much you love your Nahida, bro. I am stuck on the wrong side of the world. Jabbery? Jabbery is cool, man. It's probably in school or something. But yeah, it's pretty odd that he didn't pop in today, man. And the stream is... We don't have a lot of time left on stream. <sighs> so your team... Your team um, despair is more like Kaya and uh, a, hard, a Hydro character, I suppose, right? Dude, I love Navia too much to not build her if I have her. If I have her right now, I'll drop everything else and just build her and focus on her. All of my resources. You are not interested in building a meta? Well, I don't know if you and you and uh, Forrest would be on the same page because Forrest is all about the meta, bro. That man only wishes for meta characters, by the way. can probably do this. Scatter. I'm getting electrocuted. Oh my shit, I'm using the wrong. I'm doing something wrong. Let's dance. Let's see if we can clear this before I get killed. You know what? Let's step out for a second real quick. Alright, let me see. That's yes, alright. 
My exploration team is Zongli, Bennett, Lynette, and Kaya. Oh, Zongli and Bennett are better though. Mm. Like I said, dude, watching me, you saw F2P on the channel, alright? So what you're going to see most on my team is Traveler, Zhongling, Barbara, Kaya, no Lisa, Amber, Lynette. They're pro they're going to you're going to see them the most, right? All right, Yaya is not free, but I got uh, uh what's her name? Her Lynette from the Sprawl Abyss, right? So you're mostly going to see those characters, and then you know with our free Primo gems that we farmed, you're going to see some Furia, and if Navia comes back out, we're going to be saving for Navia. So you see how focused I am, dude? Leave it to me. I'm not even thinking about any other characters, just the ones I want. I don't care about meta. I'm going to get characters that I like, bro. Too far? Must keep what? Raining. Dude, what was that? What killed my character? Ready, steady, go! <laughs> Bet you can't keep up with me! I did not expect this. Oh wait, let's step out of the zone for a quick second. Get this demon thing off me. Alright, now we go back. Dude, we reclaimed the safari, bro. That does look like it hurt. Oh, <laughs> yeah. What are these things, though? What are these? Bro, we reclaim our safari, bro. What is this? Oh, this was a cleansing area? I didn't know they had cleansing areas over here. Maybe I did. I just didn't remember. But my brain isn't working. Let's grab these. Alright, so the hydro the thing is underground, right? Zongli is one of my favorites, so building a Geo Grandpa is a must. That's exactly what I'm saying, bro. So let's say uh, Navia to me would be Zongli to you, right? I don't know how to fight this thing, really. Wait, I probably should change. Let me see. I would figure that I should just use elements that disrupts. This is Kaya. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. Oh, those attacks are pretty cool. It actually works like uh Give me a sec, bro, let me figure it out. There we go. Freeze! Freeze! Freeze. 
Angel Hypo, yeah. Or Yao Yao, yeah. My first priority is are my favorite characters and the underdogs. Who is your favorite character though? Activate restorative hits. Activate them? They mean activate them. So that's a, a good question now. How do you activate them? Should I use fire? Mm. Bro, it got back off its HP. So that's what I don't know. How do you activate those things that it was talking about? Let the show begin. Huh. Nice and spicy. Regeneration. Yeah, that's because I didn't destroy the things. Because I don't know how to activate them, like it said. Oh wait, I have an idea. Uh, Electro to trigger their activated state and speed up the cleansing process. Oh. Use Dendro to revive these pits and induce a normal state in them to continuously cleanse the, the Dendro Hypo. And use Electro to trigger their activated state and speed up the cleansing process. Interesting. Activate by Dendro? Dude, I didn't bring Dendro because I thought it was going to be immune. That is pretty crazy. 
You fight any other Dendro monster, they say immune, right? But you're saying I need Dendro to cleanse this one. So the element I thought was the weakest is actually the strongest. Yeah, and uh, Electro gives it hasten. Keep an eye on you. I have to go to my grandma's. They're still alive. How was, uh, things at your grandma's, bro? Oh, it said immune. I knew it would be. It, it was depressing. I'm sorry to hear that, bro. You wonder how this Earth is going to be? If she is playable? Maybe she'll be. <laughs> you want the Saritza? while it's doing this. Cube uh, for Yao Yao. You're in for a little shock. Yeah. Hup, hup. Nice and spicy. Yeah. I can fight against the Geo one. They're all pretty easy. Yeah. Um, Hadi. They're all easy. Her mysteriousness. So wait, have you, are you saying we you've seen the? I'm not even going to ask. I don't want to know the answer, bro. Wait, what? Wait, are you saying you don't know how to fight the hypo safety? Wait, what? You're joking, this bear. Oh, wait, you're dead. I need to kill this thing. There we go. It said cleanse. No. I can't get it back in time, bro. Unless I use my ultimate here. Oh, cleanse. Oh, wait. Three, three, three. Three, three, three. Yes, yes, yes. There we go. No, what? Dude. You, you have to cleanse it. You have to cleanse it before it reaches. Yo, that is crazy, man. I can see people getting like pissed off and saying, "Oh, they can't do this," because this one, this is actually a little interesting. Yeah, is the best healer. I disagree, bro. It's Barbara. No, oh, Barbara, go! <laughs> I 
Hattie, it's go Barbara, go Hattie. Die, please. There we go. Oh, it's dead? Oh, I get it. You can just unga bunga it and kill it fast with hyper boom before unga bunga it again. Stall my big sister. Oh, oh yeah, I wish I wish I'd be as tall as my big sister. <laughs> that is hilarious, Addy. La da da, la da da da. Dude, my cat. My character went to. We were doing this quest with Jungwei, bro. And main character song. Uh, he he had to sing the song for a flower, right? And the song was so bad, it triggered the flower to like turn into a whopper flower, bro. That was hilarious, man. <laughs> Can you hear that in Barbara's voice? Yan <laughs> Pesu <laughs> Crows Razor and Barbara? I just remembered that uh, someone said I should build Yanfei instead of Jin Yan. Yeah, I used to use her on my old account. I never got to use Yanfei, so I'll probably build her this time. That's one toast fine. Tasted the same as I remember. But where are those who share the memory? Wait, bro, what is that dialogue, bro? <laughs> Yeah, I'd like a four-star Klee. That's interesting. Yeah, I'll probably build her. Hmm. Let me see. I, for my second team, it's going to be Yan, um, Yao Yao, Lynette. Because the first the first team that I built was MC, Zhongling, Barbs, and Kaya, right? So the second team is going to be Yan Fei, uh, Lynette. Uh, it's Yao Yao, Yan Fei, Lynette, and someone else. I'm not sure who. I'm not sure who else. Grow, go, go. Are you mean you go, Barbara? Go. Go, Barbara. Go. Yo, how do you say? When will I be as tall as my big sister? <laughs> bro, that is hilarious, bro. Wait, that's a Nahida's voice line? Dude. Do not test do not test AB bro. That man is that man is the biggest Nahida simp in here, bro. Big sister equals Jean. Yeah, I know who her big sister is. I was shocked the first time I learned that way back when. Alright, where are we going next? I need to go collect some flowers for Farina. Why is Lisa on my team? Yeah, we need these. Lake Light Lily. Leave it all to me. Noel. Dude, don't tell me you're the biggest Noel simpatty. 
Dude, who even simp over Noel, bro? <laughs> the maid. Wait, weren't you the one who was like telling someone to build Noel because she's the maid, the maid of the night of Favonius or something? What is that underwater? Wait, what are these crystals used for, by the way? Isn't Noel the only maid in the game, bro? You build her right, she's actually pretty strong. Burst DPS? I know. People used to like do it way back in the day, bro. Because nobody wanted to use her, but one guy I think did her made a, a burst DPS on her. I think he even had her at like C6 or something, which was godlike. I also liked her, her um, burst, right? But I just think you had to have constellations to make her good. I know if you just take her and pour defense in her though, her shield could be okay. If you're the shield type of player. But why would you build a shield if why would you build a shield Noel when you have someone like Zong Li, bro? Or what's her name? Um Ningguang, who just puts up walls that just blocks blocks damage, bro. C6 with Ito's weapon. And I set on all defense. Except the circuit, she's OP. <laughs> I can bet. Well, that's the story of her burst DPS arc. <laughs> Dude, imagine being out here and you're just hearing a violin. This is pretty godlike, man. I love it. I was watching One Piece the other day. Wasn't Bonnie stuck in like a, a thing like this? The Bonnie was stuck in a thing like that. <laughs> oh, wrong way. I'm going the other way. I'm not that far into One Piece. Oh wait, how far are you, bro? Because this is pretty much like current stuff that's going on. But I'm sorry though, I won't say anything else. Alabasta? Bro, you're way far off. <laughs> so yeah, by, by the time you get to where I'm talking about, you won't even remember what I said. <laughs> Dude, do you even know who Bonnie is yet? Maybe you do because you see like spoilers on the internet or something. But you don't know who Bonnie is? Bro, exactly man. You said chess? Yeah. I don't I don't really open chess or fight for chess unless I'm exploring the area. And currently I'm not in ex exploration mood, bro. I'm just like picking flowers. <laughs> I do think she is better as a burst DPS. He does need a lot of investment like C6 for on C6 Yunjin. Yeah, I think the four stars, like majority of them, like require them to have like constellation, bro. <laughs> That's when they actually like become like really good characters.
include Noel for late game. I mean, in early game, like I said, like, if you can just put defense on her, she would be a good, um, she will be a good, uh, shield character. He said he's going to see, uh, third gear. Dude, he's going to see a lot more than that AB. A lot of four stars are also only good. As burst support. Yeah, like Zhongling and Bennett. Yeah, that's true. I have, let me show you, so I have like, uh, some fragile resin. I don't know. If you have time, some, I'll probably ask when you're here, Forrest, but if you have time, I'll probably ask you to come in and, and like, I think to see Noah's full potential. Where is my thing? Probably need to open these. going pretty smoothly all right next I think I have some resin 69 all right AB uh, thank you for stopping by today bro take care man and have a good night's sleep all right He can be a good healer early game, but as you said, other characters can replace that role. Yeah. Other characters can, but remember that she's free. She's one of the very first characters you get, right? Give me a sec, let me close my door. Yeah, she's the very first character you get, bro. I was just saying, Forrest, there will there will be like uh days when I am farming what you call it artifacts. So I was just saying like if you wanna join me you can come in and help me out sometimes, alright? I have like fifty nine fragile bro, fifty two fragile. Alright bro, I appreciate it man. What else should we be doing? If I have any idea how much resin that is, I can calculate it. <laughs> but it's it should be a lot. Over 3k resin? That's godlike. Heroes with gone? Yeah, I don't have any heroes with. Uh, who was supposed to be my next story, story quest? I probably don't want to commit to any stories today. My next story would be Nahida. We've had enough fun, bro. Let's go back to prison, man. Unless I should go fight that high that hypostasis thing one more time. I don't know. <gasps> no, 
know, I can't even ascend her. It doesn't make any sense. Talents. I will get those books for Kaya. All right, despair. I need to get Kaya of his um, talents to level 6. And then after I get his to level 6, I'll need to get Barbara's to level 6. Which one do I need for Kaya again? Yes, Kaya's Sumeru outfit looks pretty clean. Us the outfit for free. <laughs> That's what an ideal world would look like. Spring forth. Getting pretty tired of you things. Especially in this domain, because the biggest problem about in here is that every time you see the, the room close with the mist on the floor, you lose your stamina. You lose your stamina. So you can't run. And then you have ice falling on your character. This is, that is probably the biggest reason why I don't like this um, domain that much. 
you have to use a character that inflicts um, pyro to yourself. So maybe like Bennett. Bennett is a good one. This is the best way to kill these things fast. They jump. And then these things also like put a mist on the ground and that mist if you stand in it it will it will kill you. Standing in the mist. Come on, we can do it. What I don't like about the abyssmith is when he makes bubbles. No one likes when they make bubbles, dude. You know what's annoying? When you have the the one that makes the bubbles and the one that frees you in the same room. This mage is easy to kill. <laughs> it depends on which one you're fighting. I mean, they're easy to kill in general. It just depends on if you have the right element. If you're fighting the one in water, you just need to freeze him. Either you freeze him or you can use electro charge to break his bubble. If you're fighting the fire, you can use electro charge to overload his bubble or you can just use water to vaporize it. And the ice one is pretty easy. You just need to hit him with fire. Yeah, elemental reaction is pretty much what controls this game, bro. I spammed the burst because Raiden when I'll be as tall as my big sister. Kill your others first. Oh yeah. The Raiden Shogun, she can pretty much beat all of them. Yeah, she doesn't need any help. It's only dangerous when you're fighting the, the cryo one because when you hit them with electro, it does super conduct. And super conduct, it hits you sometimes. Is it super conduct or overload? One of them hit you, which is pretty annoying. I don't overload hit you. That unlucky. <laughs> That's what I needed. I just needed the stardust. <sighs> now Kaya is complete for now. Oh, 
Oh, oh yeah, my adventure rank is over the limit. So when I'm done ah, streaming, I'll probably just go to the adventure rank and then make a video and post it tomorrow. I've been saying that for the past three days, but I'm actually going to do it this evening for real, for real. You have a lot of insignia. I don't even know what that is. You don't get treasure. No, I think the insignias come from the Fatui guys. Welcome back, Despair. And we're back in prison, bro. Yeah, the insignias are from the Fatui. Oh, you must be the traveler, huh? Sorry, mate, but uh, competitors as strong as you are prohibited from participating. I don't make the rules, mind you, but I was given very specific instructions. Even convicts value their lives, don't they? I hope you can understand. <laughs> but oh, that's what you call those? I just call those coins, Adonis. I just call them even coins. Earn some credit coupons in the process. I have bronze think? coins and, and silver it? coins and gold and coins. If we lose the game, will it cost us credit coupons? Of course. That's the cruel reality facing every competitor in a place like the Pancration Ring. Okay, great. Let me walk you through the rules. The targets in front of you will pop yeah, up one after silver. another. Are you not upgrading you Kaya? Because Kaya same order that they popped up. If you can complete a few rounds in a row with no mistakes, then you'll win credit coupons. But the second you mess up the order, you'll lose. Game over. The game costs 300 credit coupons to have it go. So, you up for it? You don't use Kaya? Yeah, I remember. You said you don't use cryo characters. Thanks for your patronage, mate. Now, let the game begin. Dude, I just call them coins. I just call them insignias. <laughs> the target will come up in order. When the target light turns blue, it must attack the targets in order in which they came up. So, this is on the order four times the complete shot. Conversely, attack in the wrong order. A certain number of times will cause you to fail manually. Interrupting the challenger, leaving the challenge here will also cause it to fail. All right. I wonder when I'll be as tall as. You will use your coins so great, Kazuha. Does he use those coins? He need them. I didn't know he used the coins. Yeah, this is what Adonis is talking about. Insignias. I just call them coins. <laughs> What I call something insignia is, uh, what do you call them? The Fatui guy things. Big sister. I call these insignias because I don't know what else to call them. But I call the coins, coins. And I call all of these nectar. If you have Mystic Enhancement or I'm running out of it to upgrade it as send weapon. Mystic Enhancement or I have a lot of that. You have over 400 for the Fatuis. Wait, you're still at world level 1, right, Adams? You have a lot of uh, Mystic Enhancement over Hattie. You can farm Crystal Chunks and use those to um, to, to craft um, uh, whatever you... What do you call them? Crystal Chunks? No, I'm not saying. 
You can get crystal chunks and use this to get mystic enhancement ore. I have quite a few. I don't even remember how much, but I never have a problem with those. Okay, do your best to hit the targets. Just like Colin said. man said he did the forge limit 50 a day bro oh, bro how do you i didn't even know there was a limit how do you hit the limit <laughs> you only get them from chess yeah i got a few from chess i never forged them either and i got them from um story and events as well Is have 2k berries, mints, and over 400 sensidias. Bro, what do you even use sensidias to do though? This man said he did the limit, dude. He, cr he forged 50 for the day. <laughs> I've never heard of that. Your strength really shouldn't be <laughs> underestimated. Now I get why you're prohibited from participating in any. Let's upgrade some fights. artifacts, I think. Nobody who values their life would be willing to get in the ring with you. However,. You two haven't tried betting on the outcome of a Pancration match yet, have you? Just go talk to Rusimov. Buy a ticket for whichever fighter you think will win. There's a big payout if the fighter you support you have to be comes diligent. out on top. Dude, Adonis is the hey, best explorer here. The That's why but Adonis is stacked, bro. That's normal. Just watch a few matches and get a feel for the fighters. It won't be long before you can pick winners in your sleep. Wait, do you have to ascend to upgrade your artifacts again, Adonis? I don't think so, right? Do you have Do you have five star artifacts, Adonis? Bet at random, huh? Uh well, how should I put it? Uh, it's not like you can't do that, but I'd advise you to give it some more thought first. They are trash. We shouldn't get too uh, away. Purple artifacts What's go to problem? sixteen and 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 gold artifacts go to level twenty. That's pretty much how I used up mine. What? I... Never even picked a boxer before, and you already know about the rules? You're not just strong fu- uh, Might as well tell you about it, since you already know that much. Plus, I think you've got the potential to be one of my greatest customers. I think I can let you in a bit. Besides, I don't want to risk ever losing a customer like you. Uh, is it that serious? Okay, the hidden rule here is, if you buy both boxers' tickets and support them both, something bad will happen the next morning. Yo, what's up, Ronaldo? So, the rule oh, is been, that we bro? shouldn't pick both boxers in the same fight, but if anyone actually did that, wouldn't they Dream be guaranteed artifacts? to lose coupons? Who would do that anyway? And, what do you mean by, something bad will happen? How would I know? Not like I'm stupid enough to do that. But I've heard a story about the rule. According to the rumor, there was a masked boxer who possessed incredible skill and power. None of his opponents even stood a chance against him. However, nice, in the bro, final nice. match, what are you going the organizers for, by the told way? him to take off his mask. He refused and never showed up to Adonis, the fight. Agnes, you need to figure and out what you that, what you need to do with your artifacts, again. bro, because if you Some don't, say you're died, just going to keep wasting taken them. Care of you're going to leave them on the ground when you're open chests. But everyone remembers that you can destroy the cherished on stars for more else. Can you? That is godlike. I would love to do that. Some artifacts with good stats. Uh. Yeah, you need to figure out, you need to do something with them for real. So, 
you can maximize like getting the XP from them and you don't waste them because if you just keep opening boxes you're gonna leave them on the ground that's just a waste dandelion wait dandelions again bro are you in someone else's world bro you created a new account and joined yo that is on a completely different level <laughs> usually people just harass other players right but this man don't want to do that this man built other accounts that is that is pretty interesting i've never thought of that never left the never you never left the artifacts on the ground well you said you can't upgrade your artifacts right and your artifact bag is full so what are you going to do want to find a good artifact with good stats for bennett and well that is not something that is easy to get hattie you'll have to farm dungeons bro get the perfect stats on them it that can take a minute yeah if you want to maximize your artifacts you have to use them for xp really so but the thing is despair adenis is still world level one adenis didn't um he didn't uh, ascend to the the did the second ascension so he's still world level one i think right You're world level 3? Yeah. You're right. I'm sorry. You're right. You just didn't do the second ascension, right? So you're not world level 4 yet. So what happened is... You don't have access to... Uh, the dungeons with the 5 star artifacts. I don't want to bother other players. So creating some new accounts is my only option. Yeah, I understand that, Ronaldo. To get some dandelion seeds and it's always so hard to farm those bro uh which character are you upgrading are you upgrading like who are you upgrading by the way like just yo it's a good thing you said that because now i need to check if lynette is going to need those i don't think she does though you know the sumeru archon quest <laughs> man that one was it only got interesting in the last part but for the major for majority of that that quest, like the first part where you're stuck in the dream, it was boring as fuck, bro. <laughs> Which domain has the most artifacts? It's not about how many artifacts are in there. Oh, you mean good artifacts? It it doesn't work like that, Hattie. You need to know what you want for which character, and then you farm the specific domain. We're building Jean and Eula. Bro, Eula is bae, bro. 100%. Jean, eh, she's alright. But Eula is bae, bro. 100%. In his eyes, supporting both boxers in a match would dishonor the competition itself. So you mean, it's like, a curse? He'll take vengeance on anyone who does that? Like, for example, which character are you building, um, Hadi? Which character do you need artifacts for? No, he was always wearing a mask, like he was intentionally trying to hide his identity. We don't world three. I don't even know anything about his past. Traveler, do you think resident efficient was... domain like? Marachu said emblem and deepwood. Hmm. I know I'll have to farm the witch's flame set for Zhongling. I got some decent pieces for uh from the deepwood, but I still need to go back in there and do some more. Huh? We will You're so, not serious, So we'll have the set for um Yao Look, Yao. Here I was MC. just trying to be nice and warn you yet. Here you are, trying to break it on purpose? Yeah, it sounds pretty scary to Paimon! <laughs> uh, seems you've made up your mind. Just be sure to protect Paimon, okay? Betting on both fighters will set you back about 3,000 credit coupons. If you have enough, then go ahead and give it a try. 
Just don't come running back to me if something happens. Ronaldo, if you see me on stream at the right time doing something, maybe like grinding for Since something, you can always join my world and take my dandelions, alright? supposed to do go to pancreation ring after earning 3k I already have 3k what do you mean after working here so long we're really starting to get the hang of it but doing the same thing all the time can get old pretty quickly how are you holding up See, there isn't a real Yeah, it's good to kick back and relax once in a while. Dude, I keep hearing a treasure chest and I don't know where they are, bro. Oh, just a regular meal set. Guess Paimon shouldn't get her hopes up. What would you like to do this afternoon? Uh, doing this part in uh, Fontaine Adonis is pretty boring. Because Paimon keeps asking me the same question like every two minutes. Knowing child, he must have been there all the time. Hmm? Are you two here to buy tickets? Better be quick about it. Another match is about to start. We have the reigning champ, Le Grappler, versus a contender from the Eastern Prison Block, Demon Horde. Demon Horde. Are those their nicknames, or did they choose those names themselves? Either way, super weird. Uh, since you're new around here, I want to give you a little suggestion. <laughs> Even though Le Grappler is the crowd favorite, Demon Horde is a first-class dark horse with incredible potential. Anyway, for this match, I recommend that you pick. We'll buy both tickets, bro. Uh, for, uh, for both fighters? Yes, sir. Uh, I could tell you're new to this, but I didn't think you were completely clueless. Maybe you don't quite understand the rules, no? Let me try to explain again for you. Oh, no need, no need. Um, we're aware that we're going to lose coupon. All right, then, if you're absolutely sure. Remember. No refunds once you buy the tickets. Come on, never shuts up, dude. Yeah, yeah, we <laughs> we know, man. Shut up and take our coupon. It's annoying. There's like a 10% chance of, like, every now and again when she made me laugh. But apart from that, she's just really Aww, irritating. Looks like we won't get a chance to sleep in as long as we're here. Let's get to bed early. After making. All R and R quests. After you did all the R and R quests, you're not scared anymore. I heard that quest is like ten hours or something. Hey traveler, buy mod. Package here for you. The next time you buy something, go pick it up yourself. I'm not a delivery man, you know. Dude, always just do it, bro. Huh? A package for us? More like seventy Did hours. <laughs> Why would I want to do that? So why don't you go take a look? All right. Yesterday we broke the hidden rule and bought tickets for both boxers. Some people said ten. Some oh, people said thirty-six the hours. Bad thing that Colin said would happen. Huh? Paimon suddenly feels wide awake. Wait, maybe you let Paimon go hide somewhere first. Just call Paimon after you open it. In a room full of chests. Are they good chests? Or you're talking about the common chests of the brown ones? Are you okay? Uh, let Paimon take a peek too. Oh, it's just a small bottle. But the color of the liquid in 
inside looks so wrong. Almost like. All right, that's enough of that. No need to say it out loud. Paimon already knows what you're trying to say. Ooh, no way! Get that stuff away from Paimon. Uh, Paimon thinks we shouldn't open the bottle until we figured out what's going on. Just trust Paimon in this one, okay? You hear that, Ad um, Adnis? She just asked me the same dumbass question again, bro. Though it feels nice to slack off a little, less work means less coupons. Let's make the most of our morning. I need to get out of this prison before I go crazy. <laughs> Someone reinstalled the AI. I wonder where Serban is. Oh, Serban said he had something important to do. Man, downloaded. He, he redownloaded Genshin. If there's no way to send it all out, maybe I'll never get a chance to leave. Uh, who are you? We've never seen you before, and you don't look like a fellow convict. Uh, I'm hours not. in the prison, bro. Of course I'm not. Please. Don't mistake That's me hilarious for because the stream's I'm about to end. The stream's citizen. about to end in the next couple of minutes. Then what are you doing here? You sure seem anxious about something. I'm a promoter for Fontico, and I'm usually responsible for promoting our drink products. I thought I could complete my task here quickly. Sometimes when she started talking this fair, my brain just shuts off, man. I've been here way longer than I anticipated. Oh, a promoter from Fontico? So what kind of problem did you run into? Ugh, oh, I'm so upset. It's all because of that Duke. After discussing the company's promotional plans with him, he told me outright that my project was worthless. However, in light of our long history of successful collaboration, I still tried to patiently explain the details. However, to my surprise, he just cut me off while I was speaking. <clears throat> Let me take a moment and recall his exact words. I'm just gonna stop you there and say no. If anything, I'm saving you time. It seems you don't fully understand the value of credit coupons here, nor do you understand the value of your own products. The former is because you are from the overworld. That's understandable, and I don't blame you for that. But as for the latter, only someone monumentally stupid, so breathtakingly stupid that they were completely ignorant of the value of credit coupons, despite living in the underworld, would ever possibly consider buying your drink. Let's just forget it. <sighs> anyway, that's how he rejected my proposal and asked me to come up with another solution with the condition that it doesn't cause any trouble for him. Can you believe that guy? Uh... He is the head honcho here. Not much you can do about that. We met it too and could tell that he's the kind of guy that's hard to pin down. Fine, fine. I know, I should just let it go. I'm on his turf after all. His house, his rules. forms or something? Hmm, maybe not. Every page has the Fontico symbol on it. Maybe it's some flyers from the company. Uh, okay. 
But if someone catches us, they could accuse us of trying to steal the company's secrets, couldn't they? Oh, <laughs> you're right. Guess there's nothing to worry about then. Let Paimon have a look here. Without assistance from the Fontaine Research Institute, development of the new product has been slow, and some researchers on the project have voiced concerns. We have no choice but to let the new product undergo the first phase of promotional trials without a designated name or packaging. We will adjust the direction of future development according to feedback. We have decided to only conduct closed, small-scale trials for the time being. Sure doesn't seem like anything unusual. A company is just trying to develop some new products besides Fanta. But it sounds like things aren't going well at all. Uh, let's put these papers back where we found them and make it look like nobody went through them. Okay, good. heard you crazy fools really did it. You bought tickets to support both fighters, didn't you? Well, I, did anything happen? Well, the next day we received a mysterious package, but we still haven't made any sense of the contents. So it is real. You didn't become cursed or anything like that, did you? Are, are you both still okay? Wait, are you sure that it's still you controlling your bodies right now? Uh, Paimon's not sure. What do you think, Traveler? Is Paimon still Paimon? Oh, okay. Well, that's good. Hmm. Yeah, you two don't seem to have changed at all. But I wouldn't let your guard down just yet. Still, I didn't expect you would actually do it. You'd actually throw away coupons like that just to satisfy your curiosity? Even if we bought tickets like everybody else, it's not like we could hope to earn any coupons. When it comes to things like this, it's always the organizer who makes the real profits. Hey, just what are you trying to imply? The Pancration Ring is an honest business, and we really don't make much from selling tickets. We make so little that even the current tournaments can only be held thanks to funding from the producer of Fanta. Oh, so it's the company that manufactures Fanta sponsoring the events? Paimon thought all of this was thanks to the Duke's support. Let's just say it's a mutually beneficial arrangement. They reached out to us first, hoping to promote Fanta products in the forges of Meropede. Uh, anyway, you try and take extra good care of yourselves these next few days, you hear? And we still have a lot more to do, so I think this is pretty much <laughs> welcome back, Forrest. This is pretty much where we're going to actually end the stream today, bro. Let me just go AFK somewhere. The story, I'll have to do that second part in the story slowly, man, because it's kind of it's kind of slow and boring. Do the ascension quest. I'm actually going to do the ascension quest off stream now. And I'll post a video for it tomorrow. So you guys can watch it and like it so other people can see it. I'd appreciate that really uh, very much. You said don't forget. Alright, as soon as I end the stream, I'll record it and do it, alright? So before we get going, let me say thank you very much, Adnis, for being here all day. Really appreciate it. Thank you, Forrest. You actually left. Came back multiple times. Really appreciate you, bro. Um, we'll have to do some. We'll do some stuff together in the future, bro. Don't worry about it. Despair, thank you for being here all day, man. Really appreciate you, bro. Ronaldo, you came in. Really appreciate it. Hattie, you were here most of the day as well. Thank you very much. Phoenix, you came in multiple times. I really appreciate it. Thank you. AB, you were here, even though it was really late in India. Really appreciate it, bro. Lofi, you came in as well. We appreciate it. Thank you. Hydro, you are here. We really appreciate you. That should be everyone, I think. If I miss anyone, I'm sorry. Thank you for all the lurks. Thank you for everyone who passed through and said hello. Thank you for everyone who was just lurking. Um, 
Have a great evening, night, or morning, wherever you are. I'll see you guys next time, so take care until then. All right? Bye.